Why hello there, and welcome to this quick video looking at the newest released Lego Ideas set of Disney's Hocus Pocus The Sanderson Sisters Cottage. This is going to be released on the 4th of July and will be selling for £199.99 in the UK. This set is another 18 plus set, will have 2,316 pieces, has 6 minifigures, and is 27 centimetres high, 26 centimetres wide, and 24 centimetres deep. So a very square build. It was first teased on Lego Facebook with this video that is playing in the background. So without further ado, let's get into it. So as you can see, this set captures the bewitching joy of the classic Disney film Hocus Pocus. The cottage can be opened in multiple ways, for easy viewing of interior details, including the museum gift shop, cold room with a Lego light brick to illuminate the fire underneath, book of spells, and the witch's bat infested bedroom. Parts of the house can be detached, such as the side room where Danny Jennison was captured by the witches, and the water wheel can also be turned outside to make pink smoke puff out from the chimney. Lego says this is a top Halloween gift for fantasy comedy fans. The set features six Lego minifigures plus a Thackeray Bix in cat form figure, and they come with lots of accessory elements to bring the Disney Hocus Pocus scenes to life including green lightning spells, Denny's Halloween pumpkin bucket, and the broom, mop, and vacuum cleaner the witches fly on in the film. The gate graveyard build can be used as a display stand for all the characters as well. As I've stated multiple times, there are six minifigures, and these minifigures are Wilfred Sangerson, Sarah Sangerson, Mary Sangerson, Max Sangerson, Danny Sangerson, and Alison Watts, and Thackeray Bix in cat form. The roof of the bill can be folded up to view the witch's bedroom with a triple bed, hanging cages, and bat and spiderweb elements. And the side rooms can also be detached where Danny was captured as previously stated. The instruction manual is included as well so they haven't fully moved away from making that whole digital thing yet and the booklet includes fun facts about the Disney Hocus Pocus film and interviews with the set's fan creator and Lego designers as this was a Lego Ideas idea originally. Looking at the set itself it is highly detailed and does a very good job at putting across the design of the house from the movie. which is a very square build as previously stated, but looking at the interior shots, you can see all the stuff that they've managed to cram into such a small space. And the minifigures themselves look very unique and fairly accurate to what they are based on. There is some reused elements in the minifigures, such as Jingy's hair that I can see. But there is also a nicely moulded hat piece as well, which I can also see. So yeah, that is pretty much all I have to really say on this set. It is a very impressive build and will be a set many Hocus Pocus fans will like. And is a worthy winner of the Lego Ideas 10,000 supporter task and getting through to the Lego Ideas review itself. This will be out in a few days as I previously stated on the 4th of July. So thanks so much for watching, subscribe and I shall see you when I see you. Goodbye.